Welcome to our Excel tutorial. Today, we're going to learn how to make conditional formatting ignore blank or zero cells, ensuring our formatting rules apply only to the cells with valid data. Let's start with how to ignore blank cells when applying conditional formatting. This is useful when you want your formatting rules to be applied only to cells with data. First, select the source data or the range of cells where you want to apply the conditional formatting. Go to the Home tab and click on the Conditional Formatting command under the Styles group. From the drop-down menu, select New Rule. In the New Formatting Rule dialog box, choose Use a formula to determine which cells to format from the Select a Rule Type section. Enter the following formula into the Format values where this formula is True text box. Equals is blank, B1, equals true. This formula will identify blank cells, and since we're setting it to true, it effectively does nothing. Click OK to apply the rule. Now, let's see how to ignore zero values with conditional formatting. This can be particularly useful when you want to highlight only positive or negative values and not zeros. Select the range of cells where you want to apply the conditional formatting that ignores zeros, for example, C2, C5. Go back to the Home tab. Click on Conditional Formatting under the Styles group, and select New Rule. The New Formatting Rule dialog will open. Select, use a formula to determine which cells to format, and enter the following complex formula. Equals and, C2 less than greater than zero, C2 less than equals small, if, C2 dollars, C5 dollars less than greater than zero, dollar C2 dollars, dollar C5 dollars, two. This formula uses a combination of IF, small, and AND functions to identify cells that are not zero and meet certain conditions. Click the Format button and switch to the Fill tab in the Format Cells dialog. Choose a background color that will be used to highlight cells that meet the condition. Finally, click OK in the New Formatting Rule dialog. You will see that all zero values are now ignored by the conditional formatting and only cells with the specified conditions are formatted. That's it. You've learned how to use conditional formatting to ignore both blank and zero cells in Excel. This technique can help you focus on the data that matters and enhance your data visualization. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to try these methods out on your own Excel workbooks. For more Excel tips and tricks, be sure to subscribe to our channel.